Welcome to the Your Home Sold Guaranteed Radio Show, where you get advice you can trust from the Capital Region's leading experts in real estate and all related fields. From the latest real estate trends to the best mortgage rates, from curb appeal to home warranty, this is the talk show that will help you save and make the most when it comes to buying or selling your most valuable asset. Now, here's your host, broker and founder of Your Home Sold Guaranteed Realty, The Property Shop, John Bevilacqua. Good morning. Good morning. Good morning. Good morning, everybody. Good morning, Capital Land and everybody else that's out there listening. Yeah. You're live streaming it. Good morning, Egypt. Good morning, California. Yeah. Good morning, Latham, New York. There you go. Got a little snow in the air there, guys. Yeah. Where? Get you out there. This Outside. It was yeah. Benny and I yeah. were walking from the car. We got Ben Forcucci in the studio today for your one funding. Good up, morning. Benny? How you I doing? I dig myself out this morning. No, it's not that bad. It's not that bad. Ben's Just up there on uh, Troy Schenectady Road. It's, <laughs> yeah. Very, it's no snow. There. Very high elevation. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, I, yeah. It's not as cold as I thought it was going to be. I, I was watching the news before I headed out, and I thought it was going to be a lot more frigid. Yeah, tonight. Huh? Tonight. Tonight. Tonight's tonight, going to yeah. be pretty cold. Yeah, down to the teens, like uh, 12 oh, to 14. Oh, yeah. So, yeah. Here we go. And it's going to be 60. But that is going to go right back up. Yeah. So. Craziness, craziness. Yeah, wow. Yeah. Well, 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 well. Sounds so, like anyway. sounds like the interest rates up and down. It's like a <laughs> merry-go-round, right? Isn't many seasons, bit? many seasons. The, the, yeah. yeah. Oh my gosh. Yeah. Um, we're gonna get into that. We got Ben here. Um, got an interesting topic we're gonna discuss today. Um, that's pretty relevant. I think we're gonna we're, we're gonna hit the the uh, pre-approval process. Um, oh, you know, button. which leads us into something because last week, yes, I got a text. On our phone line, okay, four seven six fifty nine hundred. Yes, if you want to call? Guy was afraid to uh, to call, but he did leave a text and he had a question, okay, which I probably could have answered, but no, that's I'm not the expert here. Okay. You guys are, and we'll get to that. I got. I actually have another text, which which goes along yeah. in, in what you're talking about. Yeah, I maybe act- it's the same guy. I got it, and I didn't <laughs> tell Ben about this in the in the in the green room, but yeah. I, I've got yeah. a. I've Listen, got, don't surprise put, me on we're air. We're putting him on right. the spot. <laughs> what is we're that? making no, no. live radio. Pretty guys. early on a Saturday. Let's make it. Ben can handle this. Let's make it interesting here. So uh, before we get into all that, I just want to let everybody know the reason why we do this show every Saturday morning is to bring the good listeners that are um, looking to buy, sell a home, or just interested in real estate. The the idea behind the show is to bring you guys the most up-to-date information, tips, tricks, ideas, market conditions, uh, pretty much anything uh, that we can impart our wisdom and knowledge of being in real estate for eons and eons between Ben and I, I a combination of years of experience uh but it's to bring you guys that that information and and educate people about how real estate works it's what we've been doing for a long time we're not bragging we're just applying for the job of getting you a loan Mm -hmm. from ben or me helping you buy or sell a house so uh, many moving parts so there's a lot of moving parts a lot of moving parts so this is a call-in show guys so four seven six actually five one eight four seven six Five nine zero zero. Give us a call. We got some text message questions, and we're going to get into the pre approval process after a quick sponsor break. To schedule an appointment with John Bevilacqua to help you buy or sell your home, call 518 957 SOLD or go to johnnyhasthebuyers.com. John will be right back with more of the Your Home Sold Guarantee Radio Show here on Magic 100.5 and AM 590. Hey, it's John Tesh. If you're thinking of selling your home, let me take the stress out of deciding which agent to hire. In the capital region, the agent I recommend is John Bevilacqua, founder of Your Home Sold Guaranteed Realty at the Property Shop. So for two decades, John has helped more than 2,500 families buy and sell the place they call home. That's a solid track record, one that's backed up by dozens of five-star reviews. Hello. In fact, John is so confident in his marketing system to attract the right buyer for your home that he guarantees to sell it at a price and deadline you agree to, or he's going to buy it himself for cash. And he provides that guarantee in writing. The agent I trust is John Bevilacqua, and he's the agent you should trust too. His name is his promise, Your Home Sold Guaranteed Realty. So write this number down. It's 518-957-SOLD. That's easy. 518-957-7653. Or go to johnnyhasthebuyers.com. I love that one. johnnyhasthebuyers.com, and you'll get your home sold guaranteed. Finding the right mortgage can be stressful. What's really the best rate? Which term makes sense? Hi, I'm Ben Forcucci at Freedom One Funding in Latham. We work with 10 different lenders who provide 100 different mortgage products. I'll listen to what your needs are, and then I'll do the work to find the right option for your particular situation. We have special expertise in helping first-time home buyers. So eliminate the stress and call me today at 542-LOAN. I'm Ben Forcucci from Freedom One Funding, and I'll do the shopping for you. Call 542-LOAN. 
Hi, I'm Matthew Stonecipher, owner of Ace Home Inspections. Whether you're buying or selling a home, let your agent know that you want to work with Ace Home Inspections because you insist on the best home inspection services in the Capital Region. You can also expect a home warranty, pest inspection, and mold assessment included at no additional cost. You deserve better than just a guy in a truck with a notepad. At Ace Home Inspections, we are fully staffed and here for you when you call 518-727-7091 or visit us online at acehomeny.com. If you're buying or selling your home and would like to schedule an appointment with John, call 518-957-SOLD or go to johnnyhasthebuyers.com. Now back to the Your Home Sold Guaranteed Radio Show and your host, John Bevilacqua. Okay, guys. So now that uh, now that we know that we got a couple of uh, questions that yeah, have been texted in, so I want to tackle those first. All right. Um, but I, 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 maybe we'll handle those first half of the show. The second half, I really do want to get into the the pre approval process. But Johnny, what's the question? Well, we're we're getting right there. The yeah. pre approval. Okay. So what do you get? This you guy, get? The guy's name was Harry. He says I don't like to call in. Okay. So I'm going to leave a text. Well, Here good you. morning, Harry. All okay. Right, Harry. Yeah. And he said, "Do I need a pre approval to see a home?" So it sounds to me like he's he wants to go and look at houses uh, or a uh, open house or something without a pre approval. Okay, I mean, yeah. okay, I, I think I you guys handle that one. I've I got to keep my big mouth shut. <laughs> well, let's, well, let's yes. I've Here's got my deal. take on yeah, this. Let's right. hear from uh-huh. the, the, the yeah. mortgage guy this, first, right? That's right. You know yeah. what? I'll be honest. You know, three, four, five years ago, you could probably go out and look at some houses. That's right. And check yeah. them out. Yeah. Because um, there was a whole different market. now. Without a pre-approval. Without a pre-approval. Right. Yeah. You know, yeah. these days, you're not walking into somebody's house, you know, without a pre-approval. So they know they've talked to a local yeah. bank or lender yeah. or credit yeah. union. Yeah. Um, it's really important. It's not important anymore. It's required. Oh, you okay. Know, oh, yeah. I didn't know it was required, but yeah. you know, it's, I think it's a good idea. I guess it's for safety. <laughs> well, you don't yeah. want anybody wandering around your house, you know, in a, during an open house and just uh, checking it out for whatever reason. I, I mean, COVID kind of changed the, 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 the yeah, way the, the game okay, was played yeah, because right, yeah. we just couldn't let people in homes to begin yeah, with, right? Let alone, you know, carrying the 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 virus. Yeah, but yeah, it, then it became like, well, yeah. Let's just make sure they're pre-approved on top of that. So yeah. then it became mm-hmm. the standard, uh, yeah. essentially. So it, right. it you know, makes I guess to perfect an- sense. To you answer- have to protect the sellers out there of who yeah. may be working exactly. in your house for yeah. the wrong yeah. reason. It, right, I know? mean, really, thank <clears throat> pandemic. It probably should have been something we should have been practicing years before that. It's like, right. why would you let somebody in your house that can't afford to buy the house? Yeah. I mean, it so just doesn't It hasn't been vetted in some way, right. you know? Yeah, yep. yeah. <clears throat> it's, it's, you know, you're wasting, right. you're wasting people's time. So, so I, the, I hope yeah, that yeah. Good question, answers Harry. your, your question. Go, Harry. Get that pre-approval you. if you want to go out and look. So now the question I have is from Paula from East Burn. Okay. And Paula is... Her kids, or her daughter's buying a house, her daughter and fiance, and she's asking that, let's see, let me pull it up here. Um, she wants to know, hey, my daughter and husband are in the process of buying a home. Do you have an opinion whether to do a 30-year fix or a 10-year arm with a lower interest rate no. with the hope to refinance if the rates go low enough? There you go, Ben. Mm-hmm. There, ben, now that's, yeah. a, that's a good question. <laughs> I only yeah. get that six or seven times. Well, I was going to say, this is common, but it's a good one. <laughs> yeah. You know, I'm a I'm a fixed guy. Okay. Okay. Um, you're you're married to the home. You're not married to the rate, yes. as we say. Okay. Um, everybody, when you work out the adjustable numbers, they're a little bit different. But they're a little bit different. But I think going fixed and waiting for the rates to come down and do a refinance in the future is still a best a good way to go. You know. Yep. It's just like if you like to gamble a little bit. Yeah. You know, if you want if you want to gamble and go into an arm. Um, you know, then then do it. People have made out well with it, but I'm a I'm a fixed guy. Yeah, and I think it also depends on your situation. I mean, we have yeah, yeah, we have does, so yeah. many buyers that come to us and say, "Hey, look, you know, we're only here for five years and we're moving down south." Yeah, yeah. there you go. So, okay. so and perfect situation. So yeah. in that situation, like take the arm and run. Yeah. Like you know, it, it make it'll make sense for you in that position. But you got to be careful because. What people don't understand is that plans in life change. Yeah. <laughs> so and, the, and if rates go the other way well, yeah, when it's yeah. coming due. You're, yep, you know right. you got to be um, um, you got to be careful. Uh, for one thing, when you're getting pre-approved, we don't if we don't ever pre-approve you on an adjustable rate. When right. you get pre-approved with the bank, they're going to look at a they're they're going fixed rate. Yeah, all right. So yeah. it's not like you're going to get more money out of it for a pre-approval either. And okay. it's going to so usually a pre-approval is going to be based on a thirty-year fixed usually. Yeah. <clears throat> and if you and qualify then, in that. 
you'll you'll qualify on the adjustable. Right. It's the same thing. It's the same yeah. qualification yeah. standard, which that leads us into this whole process of pre-qualifications. Mm-hmm. And really, the first place to start, Ben, and a lot of people don't realize this, is, is forming a relationship or trying to figure out who the best lender to work with is. And I'm not mm-hmm. doing this to put you, you know, I mean, this is great PR for you. Yeah, but, take it. But yeah. you got to take yeah. it. So, yeah. it, you know, it's just like the process is finding the team, right? So mm-hmm. with us, with the with the VIP homeowner service, like you're already on the team, you work on the great real estate company, we're going to award winning team. We got guys like Ben on the team that can help you get the process started for pre-approval. And that starts with you, correct? Absolutely. Yeah. 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 So it should start with me. It should. I I get. <laughs> I have. <laughs> That's right. I have purchase contracts that come to me via email from previous customers with a note on there. Hey Ben, we bought a new house. We're selling our other house, and I never even talked to them. So I just keep my fingers crossed when I update their credit. But yep. it's not the way you have to do it's it. It's not, not the way. The way no. You do it. Yep. And this nope. and this leads into Harry's question. It's like you're not starting the whole mm-hmm. home shopping process without pre approval letter anyway, because not going to let the house. Yeah. Absolutely. So yep. um so it it really starts with that. It's, and there's too many things to know when you're when you're about to go shopping for the house. There's too many things to know, and you should be more educated about before you go looking at houses. That's true. You know? That's true. Yep. But and then so so now let's say they've they've you know they got a relationship with us. They they know what they're doing. They're going to start to gather documents, right? That's mm-hmm. that's the next step. What do they, what do they need? What's what's the, their basics? What do they need know, in the briefcase? The, the, <laughs> Pay stubs, you know, that if they're self-employed, you need tax returns. If they're not, you need W-2s, all right? But the most important part is their income, okay? okay? One of the little things to be careful about these days, and it happens a lot, is if, Johnny, if you're a 40-hour-a-week um, worker, yeah. okay, you're not salary. I wish right? I was 40 hours a week. Okay, yeah. yeah. Um, so... We, and I get the, you know, four to six pay stubs in, I'm taking a look at them, and, and you've only worked 34, 37 40 hours, yeah. it clicks into variable income. Mm-hmm. And you're not going to get that 40 grand that you think you're going to make this year because it might be a newer job because you haven't been averaging 40 hours. You're going to make more like 33,000. That's what the bank's going to approve you on. Okay. So if you're, and hey, if you have paid time off, vacation pay, that doesn't count. Okay. It's when you take a day off and you don't have any time and now you only work 31 hours for the week. Mm-hmm. That's getting built into your average. So, me just getting a look at your pay stubs, you know, and for the first conversation is a big deal. Okay. Okay. Everything else will fall in place, what your you know past jobs were, but the where you're working right now is the most important part of it. Okay, and, now Ben, here's a question, excuse me. Sure. <clears throat> if you're not if you're retired, mm-hmm. you're not working, yep. You have other income. Yep. What do you do? You get you get to you get to use all your fixed income. Mm-hmm. And if you're working a part time job, you get to use that. You know, you you get to use everything. You okay, know, I have right. a lot of, it's amazing how many customers I have that right. are fixed income that are looking to buy their second home. They right. Get yeah. Yeah. Pension, oh, yeah. social sure. security, et cetera, et cetera. Yeah. yeah. Like and a they're camp. working. They're like still a working. camp. Like yeah. a, yeah. Uh, I don't think Johnny's buying camps at his, I think he's no, going I'm to not, Florida. No. He should be going to Florida if he's smart or somewhere <laughs> no, warm. No, like well, you know, you know, yeah. it's funny. <laughs> it's, a, it's a great question too is, um, my elderly clients, you know, that, that are up in their high sixties and seventies, it, they're more active. Mm-hmm. At that age, because now they they can yeah, the get time. their pension or social security. Don't you like to be called a senior though versus yeah. elderly? Well, you know, I don't know. <laughs> <laughs> they they are able to go back to work full time and not get penalized for That's it. That's right. So yeah. now they yeah. you know they're right back in the game. Well, I now yeah. I'm full time. Yeah. I got my pension, social security. Yeah, mm-hmm. let's let's go. Mm-hmm. Yeah, right. And yep. Does that job has to be seasoned for a period of time to count? Not a not a full time. Not a full time. No, a lot okay. of people have gone back to work full time after retiring for mm-hmm. ten years. You okay, know, they they did their part of golf and everything, and they're still very healthy. Like they want to get back in the workforce. You know, it keeps their keeps their mind going. It does. Yeah, yeah. but yeah. the but the part time job might not necessarily help. From an income standpoint, it would if they were there for two years. If they're there yeah, for two they years, right? Be there for that's two what years. I'm saying. That's yeah. got to be seasoned for a couple of years. Yes. That's what I thought. Yep. Okay. So, and then after you kind of figure out the income situation, you got to you got to verify the employment. Yep. Correct. Yep. yep. Got to. Yeah. That's and that's that's always part of it. We, and and you know we don't ever we we always, we don't ever want to forget to tell people don't don't change jobs. Yeah. Or just mortgage buying process. Yeah. Okay. Because you never know how their pay scale is, etc. Effectively, it's okay to do that, but we got to make sure it's the same income. It's paid the same way. Now mm-hmm. you're going from salary to hourly. They're only guaranteeing you 36 hours a week. So, yep. yeah, yeah, it's just as important. Yep. 
Credit history. Yeah. Right? What's Big more time. important than that these days? Because it's not, you know, it used to yeah. be just about buying a house. Now yeah. it's about used getting to be an going apartment. going down to the bank and they knew you. Mm-hmm. And, oh, it's Mr. You know, Mr. Jones is here. Yeah, and that's what you know, did. He's yeah. a good, outstanding citizen. Not anymore. No. Yeah. We no. do as many um, conversations with clients and pull their credit than, than as many online that are going through our website. I'm going to ha- I'm going to have to cut you off cuz we're okay. already at the halfway break. Okay. So we're going to pick up on credit right after up. the break and finish out the pre-approval process with Benford Kitchy Freedom One Funding on the Your Home Soul Guaranteed Radio Real Estate Talk Show. To schedule an appointment with John Bevilacqua to help you buy or sell your home, call 518-957-SOLD or go to johnnyhasthebuyers.com. John will be right back with more of the Your Home Sold Guarantee Radio Show here on Magic 100.5 and AM 590. Finding the right mortgage can be stressful. What's really the best rate? Which term makes sense? Hi, I'm Ben Forcucci at Freedom One Funding in Latham. We work with 10 different lenders who provide 100 different mortgage products. I'll listen to what your needs are, and then I'll do the work to find the right option for your particular situation. We have special expertise in helping first-time home buyers. So eliminate the stress and call me today at 542-LOAN. I'm Ben Forcucci from Freedom One Funding, and I'll do the shopping for you. Call 542-LOAN. Buying or selling the place you call home can be stressful. When you have questions, you don't want to wait for answers. Well, for 20 years, Kim Salerno and her team at Salerno Law have built a solid reputation with buyers, sellers, and real estate agents as fast, respectful communicators. They know Salerno Law will protect their rights and respond quickly when a question arises. Trust Salerno Law. Call 518-309-3404 and check out their five-star reviews at salernolawny.com. If you're buying or selling your home and would like to schedule an appointment with John, call 518-957-SOLD or go to johnnyhasthebuyers.com. Now back to the Your Home Sold Guaranteed Radio Show and your host, John Bevilacqua. Okay, that was a real quick break. Yeah. Um, okay, so... Guys, we are talking. We're back on the Your Home Still Guaranteed Radio Real Estate Talk Show. We're here with Ben Forcucci from Freedom One Funding, and we are tackling the pre-approval process. So first couple of steps we talked about is your initial consult with a lender, mm-hmm. you know, hooking up with somebody like Ben to make sure that you got somebody that's on the right page, can find the right products for you, and you're going to need this pre-approval to start the home buying process anyway. Because yeah. Harry, the text it in, the biggest question was, can I see a house with a product without, without a pre-approval? And no, you can't. Mm-hmm. Well, um, are there some exceptions? Yes, but for the most part, you're not getting in the house without some sort of proof right. of, of, of purchase. <clears throat> when I get my clients say, Ben, we're putting 50% down, it's okay. Yep. You're, you're good to go. Yeah. Yeah. Yep. So uh, we talked about proof of income, employment verification, credit history, um, which, I mean, it, it, it speaks for itself. Like, you know, there's programs that work for all sorts of credit limits. So let's let's talk about that because you don't necessarily have to have amazing credit, but you can't have horrible credit. So kind of where does everything fall into place? Well, here? you know what? It's really important that you that we pay attention. First of all, you can apply on my website online. Okay. With, with the exception of no date of birth or social security number. I'll, we'll have a conversation to get that. Let's okay. keep it secured. Because um, some people are at work that can't talk during the day, et yeah. cetera. Um, but it's really important because you might not even be able to get an apartment. Let's say you're saving for a house. You're not there yet. But yep. if you don't have your credit in line that you're starting to make, you know, on-time payments recently, you're going to have trouble. Car loans, apartments, and you know, and especially about the house. So we take a look at it together and we go through each debt. We go through each payment. We go through the car. We go through the credit cards. I let them know if they have too, they're using their credit cards too much and they're too close to the balance Mm -hmm. of their uh, limit. I mean, excuse me. Yep. Um, so that's really first step for everything. Yeah. Yeah. And and it's not the end of the world because Ben has a, he's got an app called the, what is it called? The credit. It's it's a simulator. Simulator. Credit simulator. Yeah. Mm -hmm. So, so just because you're weighing in in the sixes doesn't mean that we can't help you get up pretty quickly yeah yeah yeah. Yeah, not a year from now if you do it you can do it 60 90 days and get that a difference especially when i get them brand new and they're like well i'm going to start looking in the spring summer yeah i'm not ready yet i'm starting a new job okay let's work on the credit yeah let's get your yeah let's get your scores higher and your interest rate lower remember home buying is a process right this is not an event it doesn't happen overnight it's something Mm -hmm. that takes some time to get right and And it should and it should big deal um so we, we Next step is submitting the application. So, Ben, you just told us, like, they can go right on your website and, and yep. apply, right? Mm-hmm. Very yeah, easy. Very simple. Yep. Good. And we'll give you a call back. We get all your information, your number. We'll give you a call back um, same day. Yep. 
Here's here's a here's a um a, a catch. It's not really a catchphrase, but uh, a, a, a industry term: debt to income ratio, the mm-hmm. DTI. Right? Yep. Sounds confusing. I, I, tell us what. How does that play into this? It's whole really process? not. And it's, I mean, it is what really it says. Not. It is. It's the <clears throat> debt to income ratio. Yep. So right? basically, you take your your gross monthly income. Okay, yeah. let's say it's $5,000 a month before tax are taken out. Okay. okay, you chop that in half. You have $2,500 a month or a little bit less to work with. And that, I mean, to work with means whatever's on your credit bureau, yeah. car loans, student loans, credit cards, and your full mortgage payment. Mm-hmm. You have to add everything together, and that's where you have to be 50% of that gross $5,000 a month. So $2,500 mm-hmm. is all you can spend between a mortgage payment and what's on your credit bureau. Okay. So a little more involved in that, but not really. You know, okay. we, we do our debt ratio in two minutes. Okay. I'm like, okay, you know what? I think you got to pay off this card, this mm-hmm. credit card or something else um, in the next month or two to get you in line for where you want to be. Okay. All right. Um you know, I try to work backwards every time I talk to a customer. I don't start out with their credit scores and go jumping right into their pre-approval and their debt ratio. Is Johnny, what do you? What's your rent? What are you paying right now? Oh, I'm paying fourteen hundred. Uh, okay, you know, where do you want to be for a house? Oh, two hundred thousand. I'm like, okay, you're not going to really have any sticker shock. Mm-hmm. But some people are paying. You know, they're with their buddy and they're paying six hundred dollars a month. I'm like, it's going to be a sticker shop situation. Yeah, uh, yeah. Shop yeah, situation. yeah. yeah. you're going to go to eighteen hundred dollars a month all in. Yeah, you know, and they back off right away sometimes. Like, I don't want to be that high. I'm like, mm-hmm. okay, then you yeah. don't want to be at two hundred and fifty thousand. Yeah. So then we go into the debt ratio. Yeah, we got some else. nice shacks out in the country. Yeah, yeah. sure. <laughs> we got a nice creek out there. Uh, yeah, well. there's, a, there's a tent on five acres. <laughs> so, um, I, but it, you know what? That's the reality of this market, though. I, you know, I, I'm not. I'm I'm joking, but I'm not. It's like yeah. you know, it's really mm-hmm. tough to be mm-hmm. under two hundred fifty thousand dollars and find what you want. Yeah. You know. You know what? You know what the important thing is too, like. It's it's uh, a little shocking how much certain houses go for if you shopped in the past and now you're shopping now, right? You know, yeah. But it's also shocking of how much you're going to get a hit for rent. You're not going to escape the living expense. Well, that's rent it. Or a house, well, that's you know? it. You know, it's it, you know, you, you have people that are so um, payment uh, sensitive, and it's just like you know, you're telling me you only want to spend eighteen hundred, but where you, you're not renting an apartment for less than that. Yeah. So why you know why. Why not build equity? Why not yeah. even spend a few? And, and a lot of one these of people your most important assets qualify you'll ever for have. a four hundred and fifty thousand dollars house. Like, ah, we only want to, we only spend eighteen hundred. Mm-hmm. It's like, well, then keep renting and throwing your money away. Yeah. Like, it doesn't make any sense. Yep. But you know, exactly, it's the hardest part about a realtor. Nobody listens to you. But anyway, <laughs> um, not true, Johnny. Not, not true. true. Right? Not true. Come on. So verification and underwriting is probably the next step. And. Mm-hmm. Walk us through, like, what is actual underwriting? What's the process? The underwriting is basically I'm an underwriter, right? Yeah. In my office, I get, you know, everybody's loans. I get them together, and I look at the income, their past income, mm-hmm. you know, what their debt load is. Then we get all their all their paperwork, right. their pay stubs and all their tax returns, driver's license, and then we ship it right to the underwriter that's lending the money to you okay. directly, okay. okay? Basically, does he or she agree with me? Mm-hmm. Now, I don't know about the income, Ben. Where are you getting this, you know, 3800 a month? And we have a conversation, Some just like you. Sometimes they listen to me. Yep. Sometimes they don't, okay, yeah. where this customer is trending. Um, so then when he, then we come to an agreement, then they actually issue a commitment, which mm-hmm. is a full approval from that bank. Okay. Like, not only are you pre-approved, you're all set with the loan, too. Yeah. Okay, so your loan's in process now. So mm-hmm. does, does underwriting happen before pre-approval? <clears throat> By me. By you, yep. right? Initial underwriting. I do all pre-approvals, and yep. then final underwriting is when commitments issued after somebody's bought the house and they've Correct. fully applied for the yep. loan. Okay. Here's here's the tricky part. All right, if you go, if you come and I'm underwriting a deal and they have a house picked out and it's right on the fence. Yep. All right, I will put in a. It's, um, it's called to be determined um, pre-approval. Okay. I ship my I ship that file right to my underwriter so he can look at it and see if he has any issues with it that I'm not seeing because it's a really tight deal. Okay. So okay. sometimes we have to go to the next level. Okay. Okay. So now let's say we ever you know this particular person passed the sniff test. They mm-hmm. get the letter. What's on it? Like what is this, you know, what's the big deal about this letter because that you, it, you need it breaks to down to, if, to the seller of really, you know, who this buyer is. Mm-hmm. What's their credit? What kind of loan they do and how much money they putting down? Okay, what's like? How long do they need to buy the house? Are they going to be in an, in an apartment for the next eight months? You know, they got to be in there for a while. 
So it has everything in there. Everything. Everything. And then yep. the next call is to me. Mm-hmm. Call John Bavlacqua. Get your mm-hmm. pre-approval letter. Was out Amazing. Looking for houses. So listen, <laughs> we're going to take a quick break. Quick response break. Come back. Wrap up the show. And... Finish up pre-approval process with Ben Forkuchin and Free One Funding. To schedule an appointment with John Bevilacqua to help you buy or sell your home, call 518-957-SOLD or go to johnnyhasthebuyers.com. John will be right back with more of the Your Home Sold Guarantee Radio Show here on Magic 100.5 and AM 590. Finding the right mortgage can be stressful. What's really the best rate? Which term makes sense? Hi, I'm Ben Forkuchin at Freedom One Funding in Latham. We work with 10 different lenders who provide 100 different mortgage products. I'll listen to what your needs are, and then I'll do the work to find the right option for your particular situation. We have special expertise in helping first-time homebuyers. So eliminate the stress and call me today at 542-LOAN. I'm Ben Forcucci from Freedom One Funding, and I'll do the shopping for you. Call 542-LOAN. Buying or selling the place you call home can be stressful. When you have questions, you don't want to wait for answers. Well, for 20 years, Kim Salerno and her team at Salerno Law have built a solid reputation with buyers, sellers, and real estate agents as fast, respectful communicators. They know Salerno Law will protect their rights and respond quickly when a question arises. Trust Salerno Law. Call 518-309-3404 and check out their five-star reviews at salernolawny.com. Hi, I'm Matthew Stonecipher, owner of Ace Home Inspections. Whether you're buying or selling a home, let your agent know that you want to work with Ace Home Inspections because you insist on the best home inspection services in the Capital Region. You can also expect a home warranty, pest inspection, and mold assessment included at no additional cost. You deserve better than just a guy in a truck with a notepad. At Ace Home Inspections, we are fully staffed and here for you when you call 518-727-7091 or visit us online at acehomeny.com. If you're buying or selling your home and would like to schedule an appointment with John, call 518-957-SOLD or go to johnnyhasthebuyers.com. Now back to the Your Home Sold Guaranteed Radio Show and your host, John Bevilacqua. Okay, guys, we are back. We are just wrapping up the show with Ben Forcucci. We just finished the whole process of getting pre-approved, the ins and outs of it. Um, we did just also find out from Johnny Gabriel that the 518-476-5900 number, the mm-hmm. call-in line, you can actually text in. Now, just keep sure. in mind, though, if you want a, if you want to text into the show live, we're not going to get that text Immediately, no, no. So That'll come always, later on during the week, and then we'll then we'll we'll uh, answer your question yeah, the so, following Saturday. We're here every Saturday. We're here every Saturday. So, Wait. so if there was a topic that you liked on the show, you want to text in later. That's fine. We'll we'll pick yep. it up um, next week. But we, we always prefer a live call. And if you you know, you know the show's mm-hmm. almost yeah. over, so but probably, you do have that that choice. A little too late to call in, but I do also want to talk about the VIP homeowner service because that plays really well into uh, working with Ben uh, being. Uh, in involved in the in the whole process of buying a house, I mean, there's a lot of awesome deals. The spring market's popping, guys. Like it's starting to hit. You can feel it. Starting to get a yep. little tick of inventory mm-hmm. here. Um, and you know, you're not going to find these houses on Zillow. You're not going to find the. You, you got to work with an agent. You got to work with our group, the VIP Homeowner Service. We find you off market properties, unlisted homes, bank foreclosures, company owned properties. Pretty much anything constitutes a good deal. These are the deals that hit my desk, hit my agent's desk before they go live into the MLS or go into the syndicated fees. Um, and usually by the time they hit those feeds, they're sitting there, it's old inventory, it's stale, it's overpriced, yeah. it's yeah. over, you know, picked over. You're a few and, days behind. Yeah. yeah. And so so those are the deals that we're getting on the VIP Home Under Service. You sit down with us, we take down your home buying criteria. It's, it's a nice process, and there's some big benefits at the end of it with a home warranty and uh, an award-winning service from our team. So, Ben. Have we not hit everything with pre-approval? I well, I hope so. so. Five yeah. seconds. How do we get a hold of you, Ben? <laughs> 518-542-5626. 542-LOAN. 542-LOAN. Yes. And you can go visit uh, the website? Yeah, freedomonefunding.com. Freedom Funding. It's right on there. right online. Yeah. Um, yeah. So, Ben, want to thank you again. Always My a pleasure. good show. Always good, good to have you on here. Next week, got a new special guest. Who's Mike, that? Mike, uh, Matt Moore. Matt. Sorry, Matt. Matt Moore from uh, Moore uh, Insurance Services. Gonna He's talk. one of the good ones. He's a good one. Yep. It's going to be a good show next week. We're going to talk everything about 
home insurance, protecting your house. You got five seconds. Thank you very much, guys. Have a great Saturday and have a good weekend. The Your Home Sold Guaranteed Radio Show is presented by Your Home Sold Guaranteed Realty, the property shop. Join broker and founder John Bevilacqua every Saturday morning at 830 to hear about the latest real estate trends here in the Capital Region, where to find the best mortgage rates, home insurance, home warranties, and more. To speak to John about buying or selling your home, call now to schedule an appointment. 518-957-SOLD. That's 518-957-7653. Or go to johnnyhasthebuyers.com. That's johnnyhasthebuyers.com.